name is Rose Jerumoga and I was born normally with the two legs. I used to go to school like the others. In my life at school it was good. I started well. And one day it came that when we were in school and I was coming from school, I just felt I had a severe headache. I just talked to my friend. I told her that my head is paining so seriously. And because we were going home, I just went home. I met my mom at home. I told her I have a severe headache. She went to a nearby chemist. She bought for me some painkillers. And then I rested in my bed. But it didn't get well. So I had to be lashed to the hospital. It was discovered it was meningitis. Yeah, okay, I was put in a, in a medication. I was in a coma for one month and when I woke up I just found myself in the hospital and then my okay that time my head had stopped paining but my legs they were swollen, they were paining and they had turned okay, the, the colour had turned to be to be purplish and for one okay, about one week the the fresh started falling down and I had the olds. The doctors okay, tried to treat me and it was like I was not getting well. I started crying, I started feeling, and then I was like, maybe I'll never walk again. They decided now I had to go for an operation, which was done at the hospital, that is a general hospital. And I stayed in the hospital for, for a whole year because it was so serious that it was not healing as I was getting the medication. And even the people who came to see me, they, they started even fearing and saying that maybe I will die because it was so serious that even it, when somebody just looked at me, it was so serious. And even the doctors, they could not bandage me because if they bandage me, when they removed the bandage, it was coming out with the skin. Okay, after staying to the hospital for almost a year, I got well. I was now ready to go to the hospital, that is Nairobi, for the legs. So I went for the measurement at Nairobi, and the doctor, they took the measurement of making the prothesis. But it just shocked me because I knew I'm going to get, the doctor had told me I'm going to have the best legs than even the natural legs, the best legs than the legs that I had. But it just shocked me when I went and I felt the legs that I'm going to get. When I was put on them, it was like, even I could not walk on them, they, I felt they were too heavy for me. I could not even make an inch. And I was like, I started just crying. I just felt now my life has changed because I could not even move on my own. You have to love this person with a lot of meaning of love. You have to be very careful not to hurt their lives. So always you should know what they like, what they don't like. And then you, you, you must be very natural. Don't pretend to this person, don't be so over careful. You have to live with this person in, in a natural way, understand what hurt their lives, understand what they fear in future, and uh, basically make them see that they are normal people and they can do anything that any other person 